So here is my Insta account. So you can click that follow button. You can contact me at any time for any kind of technological queries. I am ready to help you. On the other end, like for web designing or any other courses or internships, if you want to contact us, yes, I am ready to help you. Here is the contact number to contact us. Web design series HTML. It's strength video. So context menu tags. Some menu tag in HTML. So what is a menu tag, sir? What is menu first in a window? You will have the top level file menu. You will have file, edit and everything in a window. On the other end, right click in the desktop, you will get the refresh option. Right click new, you can see folder, you can create it. That is called as context menu. So menu is classified into file menu and context menu. One. And now I am going to talk about how to create a context menu in HTML using menu tag. The tag is menu tag. Okay, once if you give that one, you are able to create a menu in the context. So in the, in the right click of the window. Okay, under that, if you want a sub item, right click new folder. In the desktop, you can do it, right? Okay, such kind of sub item I want under the menu, then it is called menu item. Let's move on to the topics learning link. This link is available in the description and in the first comment. Let's move on here to show you like how the menu tag works. So the menu tag, the tag name is menu. Okay, so menu is the one you need to give it. So this is a very big piece of code. Okay, I'm trying to explain it uh, in the bottom. So I can, sh I want to show you the output, how the menu is created. Since menu is, is displaying the data, it is coming under the body tag. So it is coming at the body tag. So menu, you will have the end menu, we in with the slash menu. And apart from that, you got the menu item, I specified something. And uh, yeah, menu will have a name. So you should have a name. You can see this is the this is a code and this is the output. On right clicking the output, uh, the menu, right clicking at the portion, you are able to see this one. This is the output. I'm going to get it for you. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on. This is how the menu tag will be. So there is a div tag I placed. And the background color is a cyan. Okay, so cyan color. So to show you the div tag on right clicking in this portion, in that particular portion, you need some special menu like this. These are the default one and I want some special. That is why you are going to read. So you should specify a name. Context menu is equal to wiki content. So this menu is called as wiki content. And so menu slash menu. Under that the ID is wiki content. And I need to give a, so the menu is ready. Under that I want the name, menu item. So menu item, label is equal to wiki wikitiki. Wiki wiki on clicking this one, on clicking this one, you should go to the website wikitiki.com. That is a JavaScript code. And the icon I want, this is the icon I want. So this is the icon I want, you can specify it. So I want a menu, a sub menu under the menu. How I can achieve it? Menu, menu, menu item. That is how you should give it. So over here you got the menu. So here menu, under that menu, you got an another sub item, menu item. Under the sub menu item, I give it tutorials. Online tutorials. Over here, online tutorials. And you want this icon. So icon.png, icon.png is here. On clicking this one, you'll be going to this particular link. So on clicking this one, you'll be going to this particular link. So this is how your context menu works. Since you are able to list lot of items, it is coming under the HTML list tag, but a menu list tag in HTML.